Hey everybody, another service call. Replacing an electrified handle. Now the old handle is not the same exact model as the new handle. So what I did was I went ahead and dry fit it uh, without cutting off um, the quick disconnect or anything like that. I wanted to make sure that it worked before I was able to uh, <clears throat> install it. Just wanted to make sure I didn't damage it so we couldn't return it or whatever. So in cutting off this, you know, wanted to make sure that all my ducks were in a row. I could look at the documentation if I wanted to find out what this is. Probably the easier way to do it, but who needs documentation, right? So I uh, <clears throat> wanted to find out what the normally open colors were on the Rex probably is in the documentation but um, I knew the white was the common and just to test this guy you know setting my meter on continuity and this little micro switch right here that's our request to exit so I am on normally open uh, powers 12 or 24 I checked it uh, before I hooked anything up uh, or I, I guess I checked it when I took the old one apart, I should say. And we've got 24 DC. And then also I wanted to show you guys this. Uh, sometimes when I'm testing voltage at the door and our programming is set up to cut off the strike on open, um, sometimes I gotta put a magnet up there uh, just to simulate that the door's closed just to get a proper voltage reading. What I've done was I took an old Sharpie, cut off the end, and I threw a door magnet in there. And I keep this in my tools, in my tool pouch, usually in here. And uh, I use this when I'm trying to simulate that the door is closed. I'll hold it up to the door position switch. And uh, that helps me out. Just wanted to share that. Any questions, comments, hit me up below. Thanks for watching.